them in their cowering fear. Draw strings! First wave fire! No! I gave these men order! I gave them purpose! I showed them their common enemy! Anchor strings! Second wave fire! I was arrow for their rage. Without a foe to consume, we devour ourselves. He speaks true. A man without an enemy defeats himself. Justify all you want. You're just a king killer and a coward. Mighty high horse, you'd do the same if you were me. Aim and fire! unharmed. Praise be to God. It will take more than a few lads with newly polished bows to fell me. The arrow was a boy. A man with a boy's brain called Avgus. Avgus? That can't be right. I could return with his head on a spear if you would like to see. No. You've no reason to lie. Yet Avgus, my old friend, had no cause to murder. He saw Lyndon as a kiln of rage. To harden the softness of its younger men. Perhaps I ignored in him what I hoped not to see. Ambition. Greed. Anger. From one man such hatred is easy to spot. But from many, it is a fog that fills the room. Power. Men will claw for it and cling to it at the cost of everything. Very true. And it is cold comfort. But glory has the taste of your family's blood. Two targets down. Only the compass remains. If it were my men killed, I would be on my way to London now. The compass will come, and we must be ready. Expecting the worst. I do not want anyone catching me off guard. Could we take the fight to him? Maybe away. Let's regroup in the church when you've had time to rest, Broger. The good sister was murdered. Where were your guards? You hear me, okay? Her blood's on you. It's a ruse, I tell you. Some surly guests outside. Eivor, we were... Uh, we, we didn't see you enter. Have you stepped out today? There's a strange feeling brewing in the streets. I've heard the shouts. The deaths of Abgos and Frieswith have angered many. Let us hope the compass numbers among the offended. I don't doubt it. But are we ready for him? It is time we focused on the compass. Gather all we know, and lay it out, plain as day. Aye. 
We let fly the feather dart, cut raven ink from a cowering quill. Now we wait, wolf tensed, for the master of the river rep to return and revenge his shaken warriors. Well, well, this one's got the gift of all its meat. What is on your mind, Stowe? We know the Compass is a sailor, a captain from Francia. And he won't like hearing he's got a leak in his hull, so to speak. With the death of the leads and the arrow, you want to hit back. But we can't know how or when. Apart from this, the man's invisible. Coward, if you ask me. Burn in your hell, you bloody reeves! Repent in! Is there another way out? The tower! There's an open window they can't have reached! I'll go up! You find a way out! I had a view of the city from the roof. There's a new flotilla in the harbor. The compass. Bastard. If we commandeered the Springles at Avgos built, we could rain a cloud of arrows on the invaders. I'd sooner take the flank and go around this army to the boats. If we cut the head off this beast, the Order's men will be easy to rout. I will go my own way. Less danger to you both. Whatever happens, this ends tonight. May God guide our swords and cover our backs. Don't be reckless, little boys. We'll see you when it's done, Erke. Count on it. Godspeed, my friends!
survey the area soon enough. enough to ford an ocean. Burning to ash what you cannot possess, that is a child's way out. To hell with London. Boudicca was right to burn it to the ground. It's a brick and mortar shithouse. So bright and beautiful set aflame. Will you rule over these cinders now? Yoke its people to your whims and needs? You do have power here. Power you have earned. I have finished my work in London. That is enough. <laughs> London is only a beginning. My order reaches further than your tiny boats can take you. Never forget, Trigger, my old friend. A man at sea may have gold and glory. But he is always a slave to the churning tides. We are that time. The Drenger we must thank for our good fortune. How do I look? Half drowned and half burnt? Not half of either. And far better for the blood on your blade. The compass is dead. London is yours to wreck or rebuild. We will rebuild. We'll strengthen the walls, reunite families, and likely use less wood or stone. <laughs> Ill-timed, Erke. I'd like a quiet moment to pray. We'll take it together. Until our next meeting. I trust you will heed my call if I should send for you. You came to London in search of a friend, Eivor. You found two. Aye, Vroga. And you deserve this. A silver ring for your raven perch. It was Triggers before he gifted it to me. <laughs> <laughs> 